Turning now to our coverage at the California Capitol, a new controversial bill going through the legislature could put the brakes on speeders, literally. Our Capitol correspondent Aton Wallace tells us about the proposal seeking to physically prevent cars from exceeding the speed limit and shares why not everyone is on board with the idea. It's a problem on California roadways, speeding. And now San Francisco Senator Scott Weiner says he has a solution in a new bill. Here's what the legislation calls for. When you hit the gas and get on the road, your car will be equipped with new technology preventing you from going more than 10 miles an hour over the speed limit. Specifically, the bill would require new cars or trucks made or sold after 2027 to come with what's known as a speed governor. That is a gadget that can monitor a vehicle's speed while using GPS technology to know exactly what the speed limit is on any given roadway. The speed governor can then physically slow a car down should it be going too fast. The goal of this legislation is to save lives too many people are dying. In fact, Senator Weiner said it's the data that drove him to author the bill. He points to statistics from the transportation research nonprofit organization known as TRIP, showing California traffic fatalities increased by 19 percent between 2019 and 2022. In 2022 alone, 4,400 Californians died in vehicle crashes. Speed is a big contributing factor. Uh, and so uh, this is existing technology that is already in uh, a number of cars uh, that the NTSB, the National Transportation Safety Board, is recommending. So this is a basic safety measure. It's existing technology. Uh, and its time has come and California should lead. But the proposal does come with its critics who say that's what the California Highway Patrol is for, not to mention this argument posed by Assembly Republican Minority Leader James Gallagher. It's just another example of government overreach, um, you know, of government control. The proposal per Gallagher could be a slippery slope leading to what he argues would be an unreasonable limitation of personal freedoms. I mean, in the future, like, are we going to, you know, control where a car can drive to? Uh, how many miles it can drive. I mean, this. these are the things that I think are very troublesome to a lot of Californians. Part of a debate just beginning at the state capitol. In Sacramento, Aton Wallace, 17 News.